So today I'll be showing you how to make a cross-chain currency conversion on Veris Desktop on the Veris Testnet. So this is a PBAS functionality that's going to come to mainnet soon, and it allows you to send from one blockchain to a completely separate blockchain uh, and optionally convert in the process. At the moment, the desktop application does the conversion automatically, but if you were using the command line and in the future when you use the desktop, you'll be able to send to a different chain without converting. So all you need to do is get the address that you want to send to on the other chain. So Moon is a blockchain created by a community member within the Verus community, uh, completely independently from anything that we've done. He just used public blockchains as a service and uh, the command line to launch his own chain. I can run Moon independently of Varus Test. I don't. It doesn't depend on Varus Test. I can integrate Moon into my applications without caring about how Varus Test works. So, if I want to convert from Varus Test to Moon, I can go Convert Currencies. It'll search for the currencies I can convert to from Varus Test, and then it detects that Moon is one of them. And if I click this, it'll automatically uh, detect that it's going off chain and it's using the bridge currency on moon to do the conversion. So I enter the destination address that I want to send to. Let's say I want to convert 100 Varus test to moon. Gives me a confirm screen and posts the transaction. I will wait for it here to show up for a second. And as soon as this uh, switches to the sent status, it has been sent to Moon, and it will arrive at the address that I specified um, around 20 to 30 minutes from now uh, in a completely decentralized way. There's no centralized services going through. This all occurs on both blockchains uh, using the bridge currency. So the moment that this switches to sent, I will turn off the recording and resume it after the moon arrives. So there you go, it's been sent. It says the time that it's been sent on, and now, 20 to 30 minutes from now, I should see it arrive in my moon wallet. Around After around uh, 20 minutes or so, and as you can see, my balance has arrived uh, on moon. It is now, here's the transaction, I mean, it's come across chain. This is the transaction ID. Uh, if you were to run a moon node and you look up the transaction ID, it's all valid, it's all there. It already has nine confirmations. So uh, if I wanted to, I could go from moon back to Varus test, again, through bridge.moon. Um, and if I you know, wanted to explore different PBAS currencies, I could go add uh, public blockchains as a service PBAS chain. And it will show me the PMS chains that have been created so far uh, by other community members. I can add them, I can convert to them if they have bridge currencies available. And uh, yeah, all this happens in a decentralized way. There's no central thing facilitating it. Uh, it's notarized by the miners of both Moon and Varus Test. And yeah, that was a short demo on how to send across chain with public blockchains as a service.